uh, doing another solar review. I will be doing uh, Iyengar Celebrator, I don't know, Celebrator, um, which is a uh, Bavarian double block, a double block, as we would say when we're dumb. Um, I figured in this case, I, I don't really have a, the proper glassware or anything, but I thought this would kind of be cool. I don't use these too often. Um, this is a Spiegelau, I think this is what they call their Pilsner glass or whatever. But, uh, let's see how this works out, huh? Um, let me get the ABV here. Where is it? 6.7, which is, I think, relatively low for some a lot of the topples I've had. And like all good doppel box, it uh, it has the um, suffix a t o r. Apparently, the first doppel was called a uh, salvator or something. Uh, I think Polliner claims it, but um, there's like uh, several hundred doppels that um, the names end in a t o r. So I mean. Let's take a look at this here. I mean, honestly, it sort of looks like like dark brown in some almost ruby red kind of a hue, especially down at the bottom, as you see here. I mean, it looks nice. Um, the head is a um, almost like like a um, like a light khaki color, almost. Uh, I had an old chief that drank his coffee with so much cream, it was almost this color. That's what I'm sort of thinking. It looks like his terrible coffee. Like all coffee, I suppose, right? Um, got a nose, huh? Hmm. I mean, that's... It's rich... It's a uh, multi, um, uh, a thing that I guess only people in New England know, but it's like that brown bread, canned brown bread. I don't know if you guys, if you guys know what that is, but I, apparently it's a New England thing. But it sort of got that. It got some um, almost like conquered grape kind of a fruitiness. Um, got some like almost herbaceousness to it too. I'm not, I'm not too mad at that. Um. It doesn't come off as as um, maybe as sweet as I was sort of expecting. Um, sometimes doppels can be shockingly sweet. Um, let's uh, see the taste. Cheers. Oh, interesting. Okay, this is quite dry. Um, it it's got that rich maltiness as um. I was sort of getting on the nose, but it's dry. It, it's um, almost has a slightly espresso-y kind of a thing. It doesn't, it's not coffee. I mean, it has that sort of, that that dark, rich kind of a finish, almost espresso-y, honestly. Um, not, I wasn't expecting that based on the nose. Yeah, I mean it's really good. Um, you you are getting that sort of that um, you're getting like sort of like cereal grains. You're getting um, like brown bread. You're getting um, sort of like some some hop character, like uh, vaguely spicy sort of in the the back. Not like spicy like heat, like almost like um, like pepper kind of like peppery. You are getting that sort of conquered grape thing too. I mean, this is really, really good. Um, the last few doppels, I just didn't really that I've had it really didn't do it for me at all, and I was sort of getting sour on the um, on the experience of drinking them. But this is this is nice. I, I this tastes like classy. It tastes like I'm having something um, nice, crafted. It, 
it's, it's really, really good. I'm, I'll be drinking this, um, unlike the last one that I dumped. Mm. It's really nice. Yeah, I like it. Um, the last couple of times I did these solo videos, I didn't really, um, didn't do any of the, uh, well, what's it like? Uh, well, NerdSense, you can find us at um, nerdsense.net. We're on YouTube, we're on Instagram, uh, we're on Untapped, we're, uh, we're everywhere on social media. So if you want to find us, you can. Uh, appreciate anyone watching us, and I uh, hope you give us a like. Um, until next time, um, I'm Mike, and this was NerdSense. Cheers.